What's up P-Timers, we've got 100 Hot Wheels cars for you, brand new in their packages. We've got a mixture of 50 pack, 10 pack, five packs, three packs, and some singles. We're going to unbox these and open them all up and get a closer look. Let's get started. All right guys, let's do this. We've got 100 cars to open up and unbox. Let's start with the Volkswagen Kiefer Racer. This one right here, it's a single car. Uh, let's open this one up. This one has the Magnus Walker on it as well. And there it is, pretty cool looking in this blue color. And it's got this white and all that on the top of it as well. And that cool like dragway style with the engine on the back of it. All right, we'll put that aside. And we've got the custom Bronco, Ford Bronco. Check that out. Pretty neat with that raised up on it. Let's open this one up. And there it is, and it's got these big tires and wheels on it, and that cool tampo on the side. It's like a, a wave on the side of it. So there it is, all right there. And we'll line them up all over here. Next up, we've got the three pack. So we've got a Thunderbird, some sort of Ford, and it looks like a Mustang. So let's go ahead and open this one up. And this one just opens up just from the side right there and it pulls out to the packaging down. And first one we've got is this Thunderbird. You can see the flames on the side of it and it's got those mesh like chrome wheels on it. Check that out. And then next up we've got a Ford and this one I think is, yeah, Falcon race car. So there it is, Ford Falcon race car. Got the Ford logo on the side, the white on it and check out the roll cage right there. That's pretty neat. All right, we'll throw that one aside. And the next one from this three pack is this Ford Mustang. You can see it's like a, like a brownish green color, I don't know. And it's black with the white wheels on there, black wheels, white trim on it. All right, we'll throw that one down on the side over here. And let's start with a five pack that I've got. So this one is the Batman five pack right there. You can see that one. Let's open this up. Batman five pack. There it is. First one we've got is this Batmobile. You can see this looks like one of the older classic Batmobiles. And then we've got this other Batmobile as well. I don't know what this one is. This is like a blue one. Looks more like a, a spaceship or something. Some sort of like flying Batmobile. Then we've got this one right here, which is, this one has the Joker on it. Check that out, pretty cool. And next one we've got, this one's like some sort of SUV. Gotham City, whoa, Gotham City Police. It looks like it even has a sunroof on it as well. And then next up we've got is this one right here, which is like a matte finished Batmobile. Oh, that's so, so weird. Some sort of weird matte finish on it. But that one's pretty cool as well. So those are all the Batmobiles from that five pack that we opened up right there. So we'll throw this five pack to the side. All right, I'll grab this five pack up here, which is a like muscle car five pack, muscle mania. Check that out. Ooh, I really like this uh, blue Daytona up at the top. All right, let's open this one up. These five packs are fun. They've always got some exclusive cars in them, ones that are fun. So let's open this up. I'm just gonna rip this open. Oh, this one's hard to get open. There we go. Got that. And let's start it off with this one on the top that I really like. So it's that blue Dodge Daytona. 
And check out the wing on that. That is awesome. Love this one. I love the black wheels with the white on it as well. That's really cool. All right, we'll throw this one aside. And this one is a, looks like a Challenger. Might be a Hellcat, I don't know. That one's really cool as well. It's got uh, some nice striping on the side of it. And we've got a Mustang, green Mustang. Check out that lime green color, that one's awesome. Cool, cool, we'll throw that one on the side. And then we've got this, which is a, is this a Firebird? Yeah, it looks like a Firebird. That one's a nice color, I like the yellow. All right, let's put that one aside. And then last but not least, uh, I don't know what this one is. Tofino? Ford to Torino, Torino, Ford Torino, there it is. All right, we'll throw the packaging aside. So these are all the cars from the five pack right there. That one's a pretty neat five pack. We'll throw this five pack into the 100 car parking lot, which is starting to fill up over here. There we go. And next up, let's open up the 10 pack that we have above. There it is, there's the 10 pack. So Hot Wheels 10, check out all the cars that are in there, so cool. All right, let's, let's not waste any time. Let's open these ones up. And this one has, there we go, let's rip it open, pull it out. And I saw this one because I was like, there's some pretty neat cars in here. The, the first car I'll pull out, which I thought was pretty neat to see, was this one. This is like a uh, Daytona, the Cobra Daytona in a yellow color. And I haven't seen this one before, so I thought, might as well pick up this 10 pack and open it on up with our 100 cars. And next one we've got up here, and this one is a Mercedes. And this is the AMG GT. Looks like the AMG GTS though. Cool wheels. And actually I noticed on here, the wheels are mismatched. I wonder if that's an error. Could be an error car, because it's got different wheels in the front and the back. But we'll put that one aside. We'll check that out later on. Maybe it's an air car. And then this one is like that skull racing thing. It looks like a big brain on the back of it. But check out like, it's supposed to be all the cylinders, but it's like imitating a skull right there. That's pretty neat. I like that. Cool different wheels on there as well. And what's up top here? We've got a Corvette. This looks like the C7 Stingray Corvette. I don't know if this is the Z06. I don't think it's the Z06 version of it. Put that one over there. And then here, I pull out another Corvette. And this one looks like the, could be a ZR1. Yeah, I think it is a ZR1. It's got the, the ZR1 on the side of it right there. And it's black with a cool striping, pinstriping, and then the colored interior on there as well. That one's really neat. Throw that one aside. Then we've got the Roadster. This one is quick. This one is fast down our six lane track. Number 04 on the side of it. There it is. Throw him aside. And what is this one? I don't even know what this one is. This one's Torque Screw. There it is, Torque Screw. Whoa, Torque Screw. <laughs> He's going down. All right, we'll pick up Torque Screw. There it is. Torque Screw number 18 on it. This is like a magenta pink color on there. Whoa, whoa, whoa. All right. And what do we have in here? And this one's cool. This one's, uh, it's either a Charger or Challenger. Yeah, it's a Challenger. I was going to say it's a Challenger or it's a Cuda, but it is a Challenger. Cool chrome wheels on there. And check out that hood scoop and all the Hot Wheels logos on the side of it as well. That's really nice. All right, let's throw that one. And this is that like Volt car, Super Volt I think is what they call it, with the white on there. And it looks like it's got like that Volt turbocharger or something in there. It's all chrome on the inside. Drag parachute possibly on the back. I guess it's supposed to be a dragster electric car. And the last one from this 10 pack, I'll throw this package on the side here. And this one, I guess yeah, this was like the bonus car for it. And this one, let me check what it is. Uh, I'm just looking up closely here. This is a Chevrolet SS is what they call it. There it is, a Chevy SS. And those uh, double stripes and one of them kind of expands on the back there. 
as well. All right, so those are the 10 cars from the 10 pack right there. Ooh, look at all those 10 cars from that 10 pack. We'll have to check this Mercedes later to see if it's an air. Both sides, there's different wheels. That's pretty cool. All right, if you guys know if it's an air, throw some comments down below. I'm gonna throw these 10 cars into the 100 car parking lot over beside me, which is starting to fill up. There it is, throw those all in there. And let's, uh, what should we go next? What do you guys wanna do next? Let's do the Street Beasts. Street Beasts, there they are. Boom, boom, boom. All right, they're beastly. Let's open this, this one up. The Street Beasts. And then we'll throw them aside, we'll take one by one here. And this one, holy crow, this one, look at like all the angles on it. It's like a, is it a snake? I think it is like a snake with an engine underneath of it. Check that out, that is crazy. And look at like the big spoiler, which is, if it's like a rattlesnake and that's like the rattlesnake spoiler on there, that one's pretty cool. I don't know the exact name of this one. And it's even look like, it's like a giant turbo engine on it look it looks like a big turbo cool all right we'll put him there and we'll grab this next one and this is like some sort of rhino one i don't know my uh character cars that well but there it is or fantasy cars i should say but this one is pretty neat got the bull horns on it there it is throw him down there next up we've got this one right here which is like a scorpion car. Look at like the scorpion things that you don't want to put your fingers in there and have it bite you. <laughs> Check out the gray wheels on there as well. That one's pretty neat. And next up we've got this one, which is like a stingray. Check it out. Never seen this before. Wow, that's awesome. Imitating the stingray right there. Wonder if this one is called the stingray. Does it say on the bottom? Let me take a closer look here. Super Stinger is what this one's called. Super Stinger. All right, we'll put Super Stinger aside. And this one is pretty cool. And this one is Raleigh Ripper. Radical Racer, my bad. I should know Radical Racer. Radical Racer I've seen before. He's a pretty popular one. Radical Racer. All right, we'll throw that packaging aside. I'll show you the five pack in my hand before we put it into the parking garage. Put Radical Racer over there. There's your five pack right there. Boom, check it out in the lights. All right, we'll put them aside into our 100 car garage. Throw it on over there. And let's, uh, let's start with the 50 pack, I think. Let's do that. Yeah, let's do that. 50 pack and 50 pack just opens up just like that. I've never even opened this before so I don't even know 50 pack holy look at all the cars that are in here. Let's open this up just maybe like this so you guys can see and actually I'm gonna take a pack right there and put it on top to keep that open and I'm gonna have to open all these here I'm gonna have to open this door up the flaps just like that and then we can get a closer look at the Hot Wheels 50 pack in there holy crap there's so many cars in this oh they're all shorty cards I guess so this one is Maximum Levy or Leeway which I haven't seen this one before so let's open up Maximum Leeway Maximum Leeway check it out like, what is all this stuff on the top of him? That is crazy. All that, all right, we'll put him aside right there. And we've got next one up, the BMW K1300R. Check that out. Wow. All right, let's open up this. I wonder if there's any like treasure hunts or super treasure hunts. I don't know if there would be in and these 50 packs, there it is, the BMW 1300K. I don't know, I'm not a big 
bike fan of the BMW bikes, so I don't know a lot about these. I like Ducatis, more, more of the sport bikes. All right, next up we've got the Dark Knight Batmobile. Clear this off here. There's the Dark Knight Batmobile. Very cool, let's open up the Batmobile. And this one is like, like a navy blue color. It's not like the standard Batmobile black color. I don't know the significance of that, if it's supposed to be or not, but it's pretty cool. I do like it. All right, we'll put that one aside. Next one up top here, we've got the Corvette C7R, blue Corvette C7R. That's a neat one. I do like this one. All right, let's open this up. Got all of these cars, so many cars in here to open up still. Blue Corvette, it's got the Hot Wheels logo on there and it's blue all up on the top. It got that cool looking wing. That one's awesome, I like that. Throw that one aside there. This one is, oh, we've got some packaging all on the ground. This one is the Custom 69 Volkswagen Squareback. Huh, I haven't seen this one before, I don't think. Maybe, maybe I have. Let's open it up. And I wonder, I don't know the, I bought this pack from Toys R Us, so it's a very new pack, but it seems like these are probably some more 2017 cars from it. No 2018 cars yet in this package. That's pretty neat though. This one, look at all the, the W on there. So I think uh, you can get like the cars to spell Hot Wheels if I'm not mistaken. So that one's pretty neat. Maybe we can get all the cars to spell Hot Wheels. I don't know. And this one is the Olds 442W30. Check it out, raised up Oldsmobile. That's pretty neat. All right, let's open her up. There we go. This one, oh, so many packaging beside me here. Hot Wheels logo on there as well. Raised up Baja style. These are popular, I think in like California and Mexico, there's people that raise up these muscle cars. I think it's actually kind of neat. I don't know if I would ever do it to a car myself, but it is, it's pretty cool to, to see. It's pretty neat to see these raised up cars. I enjoy it. All right, I'll throw that one aside. And this one's not really a car. This is the Beatles Yellow Submarine. Yellow Submarine, let's do this. We'll open him up. And ooh, this one, it's actually like rubbery right here. Oh, maybe it's not, it's more plastic. It almost felt like rubbery on there. And it's got, oh, it does have wheels on the bottom of it. So you can, yellow submarine, there he goes. And he's got some sort of fin on the back of it as well to help him. The blue Beatles yellow submarine, throw that one aside. Let's fill up the parking lot beside me here of 100 cars. All right, and there we go. We've got the 69 Mercury Cyclone. Check out the flame job on that one. All right, let's open it. Boom. And this one, there it is. The flames on that, that cool looking color on there. I don't know if it says something on the side, almost mixed in, or it's just the flames. Yeah, it's probably just the flames on there. That's pretty neat. I do like. All right, we'll throw him over there too. What is this one up here? We've got Turbot. Turbot, a cool fantasy car from Hot Wheels. Let's open up Turbot. Oh, there we go. Turbot's opening up. There he is. And this is like a matte finish on there, which is pretty neat, that's different. And even the bottom, it's like a matte finish plastic paint on the bottom of him. I haven't seen that before. That's different. All right, throw him over there. What's up top here? We've got Rapid Response, the rescue car. Let's open up Rapid Response. Let's rapidly, <laughs> trying to rapidly open him. I mean, it's hard to open. Rapid response, there he is. 
left and check it out the yellow and it's got like a whole bed in the back of it does this come off oh no damn i wish this came off that would be pretty cool if it came off there we go rapid response pretty nice throw rapid response over there what we got up top we've got the rat bad attitude or bad ratitude not attitude <laughs> This one looks like uh, one of the other fantasy cars we opened up. Can't remember what the name of it was. Radical Racer? Maybe it was, maybe it was that, similar to that. Bat, well, whatever, I can't remember what this car is called. Ratitude. Something Ratitude. And there it is, got the flames up top there. Check out the side on there as well. That's pretty neat. And those different colored wheels. Matte finish on the bottom. All right, we'll throw him over there. Join the 100 car lot. Then we've got, what's up? <laughs> what's up? I haven't seen this one before. You can see the, the zapper on there for what's up. I guess he's supposed to zap you. Let's open him. Ah, get open here. I'll have to throw this packaging aside. We'll have to puncture him. He doesn't want to get zapped through this packaging. There we go. Got them all open here. Check out the colors on there. White tires on it. That big fin on the back of it. Got those spinning wheels on there. Very, very cool. Throw him aside. Up top then we've got the custom six, no, oh, custom 77 Dodge van. That's a pretty neat looking van. There we go. Let's open them up. Dodge van. Boom, Dodge van. Check out the pink on there. That is neat. And it's got like all like the party graphics on the top of it. And it's like lowered. Oh, this one, look, it's got some sort of air in here too. So this one, the, the van is all pushed in or the, the, sorry, the wheel on this is all pushed in and it doesn't move. You can see it's, I'll show you this way. You can see when I roll it, that back tire and wheel don't move. It's all pushed in. So that's a, another air that we got. So this air with possibly the Mercedes with the different wheels as an air. Oh, next up we've got the 07 Ford Mustang. And it's got like Minecraft graphics on the top of it. Let's open this up and see. Oh, there it is. Check out the, the 16 on the top. And those are different. I haven't seen this uh, Mustang before. So some different wheels and different tires and different graphics. That's a cool Mustang. All right, let's throw these all into the parking lot here. What do we have up top? We've got boombox with the subwoofers. And this one has an A on the top. I don't know what that means. Post in the comments below if you guys know what that means. Let's throw up the A on the top and the crazy graphics all around. Check it out. Ooh, so many graphics on there. I don't even know what to say. Different colored wheels and tires, but pretty sure that's all supposed to be on purpose. I don't think that's no air there. And we had that like that police car, which had the same thing on the top there. So, or it was some sort of rescue vehicle. I don't know what it was before. All right, we'll throw that aside. Then we've got the BMW M4 in white. And this one, I noticed they have this black striping on here, but when you look at the actual car, there's no black striping. So why'd they put that black striping on there? I don't know why. Okay, let's open it up. And there it is. There we go, cool wheels. And this one has like, it's supposed to be like the carbon fiber on the roof. So it's supposed to have some sort of carbon fiber effect on it. BMW M4. I like BMWs, they're pretty cool looking cars. This one's pretty neat. White looks good. I like it. Nice, nice, good Hot Wheels. But this one's even better, the Tesla Model S. And the one that I have of this already, I believe is the fastest Tesla down our track of all the Tesla Model S's. 
So let's open this one. Ooh, there we go. Tesla, Tesla Model S in the colored rims on there, black rims with the colored lip. And the Tesla looks so good. Such a great looking car. Respect to Tesla. Gotta love the Teslas, guys. Check it out. All right, put those aside. What do we have up here? This one is the Vampira. Vampira. All right, let's open up Vampira. Vampira. Throw it there. This one is some sort of like, well, it's obviously a vampire. That's what it's supposed to be with the colored wheels on there. I don't know what this thing on the back of it is either. What is that weird thing? And it's got the, the exhaust that comes out the top there. And it's maybe like a little seat right there. Yeah, it is like a little seat in the front of it. That's pretty weird. Pretty cool. All right, we'll throw that one aside. Then we've got the Chrysler 300C and this one's all tuned out. Hot Wheels art car. And let's open it. Ooh, come on, get out of here, you tuned out Hot Wheels car. There we go. And this one, check out the graphics on it, the tempo. And even if even if you look at the, the wheels, it's like a multicolor paint job wheels on there. Great detail to that. Even the front grill, uh, the front grill is I think only one color, but it's supposed to kind of blend with all these colors all on it. That's pretty cool. All right, let's throw these in the parking lot. Throw them all in there. And what else do we got right up here? We've got a 70 Escort RS 1600. I don't know much about these. Let's open her up though. Oh, we forgot one car up at the top. We'll have to do that next. This one, the Ford Escort. There it is. Castrol number 12 on there. And this one, it, I mean, it, to me, it kind of looks like a Datsun. Someone gave me this car and said, what car is this? I would say it's like a Datsun 510. Although it's like a little two door. I don't know if the 510 came in a four door from Datsun, but still it looks more Datsun than Escort, but I guess this is the first Ford Escorts. All right, up top we'll go. The car we missed, we've got, woo, Comeback Medic. Check out that. Look at all the graphics and stuff on that. Wow, that is cool. Let's open this one up. Boom, check it out. Check out all that. That's some crazy graphics tempo on there. This one has an A on the top of it and it says crash. Again, guys, if you guys know what all these letters on the top mean, I don't really know what they mean. I mean, it's uh, if you spell the word Hot Wheels, there's no A in Hot Wheels. So I don't know what that would mean. It's supposed to spell, well, maybe it's supposed to spell art cars. That might be it. That could be it. There we go, Hot Wheels, big logo on there. Pow. I like this one, this one's cool. That was a fun car. Too bad I missed that first, but I got it for you guys. So plowed the snow plow. Check them out. White tires on there. And it's the big plow on the front. If it snows, you need to have so plowed so he can clear the way for you. Check that out. Check out those white tires on there. And he can go and here, he can even grab these Hot Wheels and he can plow those Hot Wheels. Get out of the way, boom, there we go. So plowed, plows Hot Wheels and snow at the same time too, I bet. Check it out. Even I guess this would be like a salter in there because it's got like that turning thing so it can salt the roads. So plowed, so plowed aside. And this one is flyby. And this is like some sort of like rocket sport super bike. Pretty neat. Let's open them up. Ooh, this one's got some extra protection to kind of, I guess, hold them up. We'll throw him there. There we go. Look at that. Look at the, can you imagine they put this giant tire and wheel on an actual car? And rather than a motorbike, that would be really neat. 
even the front of it, it's like this thin one from the top. You can see how thin that is. This one's pretty neat though. I like it. That one's, that one's cool. Oh, another bike. That's our, our second motorbike out of the lot here. Then we've got Cloud Cutter. I guess this one cuts through the clouds. And this is some sort of like rocket race car. I guess it's like a, maybe like a street jet car or something. I guess it's got like those big jet engines on the back of it. 55 on there. And check it out, the front clear wheel and tires and the big ones on the back of it too. That's pretty neat. All right, we'll throw him aside and let's add to the parking lot here. The parking lot is getting cluttered with cars. So here, let's pull this one out. What is this right here? We've got a Toyota Supra and white wheels on the back and colored wheels on the front, like a chrome gold maybe. Let's open up the Supra. Boom. Check out this Supra. The Nito Supra white on the front, gold, and it's got these like different tinted uh, windows on there as well. And even the spoiler, I don't know if this is meant to be like that, but if you look at the spoiler, I'll try and hold it up so you can see, there's like a little bit of a gap in it or a dent. I wonder if that's another error car. I'll have to look into that more to see if other Supras have that kind of groove rivet in there. All right, throw that up there side. Let's pick a random one in here. We've got the MR11, MR11, MR11. Let's open them up. Mr. MR11, there we go. And this one, this one looks like some sort of sports car, like a one seater sports car. And what is all this stuff on it? 2016 Hot Wheels something. Oh, I'm just seeing these are soccer balls on here. Check it out. Wow, that is cool. And it's got the white wheels to kind of blend in too. It's got the little dude on there, like I guess playing soccer or something. That's a pretty neat car. I like that. Haven't seen that car before. Throw that one aside. What else we got in here? We've got the 65 Pontiac GTO. Pontiac GTO. Look at the flames on this one. Wow. Let's open up the Pontiac GTO. There he is. The flamed out Pontiac GTO. Look at all those flames on the front of it. So many flames. This thing's like on fire. The full side, you can't even fit another flame on the side. Little Hot Wheels logo there for you to see. But it is so flamed out. There we go, there's another flames car up here. We'll grab that one too. This is the 70 Camaro. All flames on it, it's got the 70 Camaro on there as well. Let's open this one up. And black with the flames and it, this one's got like one giant flame on there whereas this one it's like all these I guess it could be one giant flame that kind of offshoots but this is more of like a regular flame job on there black on there with the red interior that one's neat and let's fill the parking lot up here throw those aside and what do we have up here we've got the 2016 Camaro SS this one says Forza Motorsports on there. Let's open this one up. There we go. And look at the stripes on there, the blue on it. That one's pretty neat. Very cool, all those stripes on there. All right, let's show this one aside. And then we've got the Honda Odyssey. All right, let's open up the Honda Odyssey, the cool looking van. I think we'd say that, right? Cool looking van, but this van is cool. Number four, it says turbo on the back, just in case you thought it was not turbo. The big Honda on there as well. So you know it's a Honda, turbocharged Honda van. 
even looks like it's got a big diffuser on the bottom there. That one's pretty neat though. I like that. I like, I like. Then we've got the 2015 Dodge Charger SRT. And Hot Wheels doesn't like to put the name Hellcat on their car, but I believe this is a Hellcat because it even does have the Hellcat logo right there. You can see kind of tiny. So it is a Dodge Charger SRT Hellcat. They just don't like to put the Hellcat name because, you know, people might think hell is bad word and you can't really have it on Hot Wheels, but that's okay. It's still a pretty cool car. You know what it is in real life anyways, and you know what it is in a Hot Wheels. So you, you don't even need to have what it is. They just need that little logo and we know exactly that it's a Hellcat. White with the black wheels. Classic, love that color design. SRT on the front of it as well. You can see, very cool looking car. All right, we'll throw that aside as well. And we've got the 2016 Ford Focus RS. Blue color, black tinted wheels. This is a fast Ford in a straight line drag race, like maybe zero to 60 you can beat the new Mustang GT in a full quarter mile. I think the Mustang would take over with its power though, in real life, of course. But there is the blue Ford Focus RS, chrome wheels on there, blacked out windows. Good detail on the front of this one as well. Check out those lights. I like that detailing and the lights right there. Pretty neat. You can see my light reflecting on the, <laughs> the car as well. All right, let's open up this one. We've got the 69 Dodge Coronet Super B. Coronet Super B. All right, let's open him. Ooh, there we go. That Dodge with the flames, more flame job cars. Gotta love all these flame job Hot Wheels cars. Very cool looking. Look at those flames, that the double flames from here, and then they kind of shoot off to the side. Pretty neat. All right, what do we have? Ooh, very nice. We've got the Nissan Skyline GTR R34. That is nice. Check that out. Number zero with all the graphics on the side of it. And there it is. If you're a Skyline R34 fan, this is dedicated to you. That is nice looking. Love the red. Reflects onto my lights nicely. There we go. All right, what is this? Ooh, we've got the 15, 2015 Mazda MX-5 Miata. This is all raced out. All right, let's open up the Miata here. This nice, cool looking red color of the Miata. There it is. It's got uh, blacked out wheels with the white lip on those wheels. That's pretty neat. I love it when they do that. Good touch to it. That nice diffuser on there, the big spoiler. And it's got like that roll bar inside of it. Mazda Hot Wheels. All right, throw that one aside. Then we've got, oh, this is a pink one, the Drifsta. Pink Drifsta. Check out the pink on that. All right, let's open up Drifsta. Drifsta. There's Drifsta Yokohama on the side of it. This is like a wide body one too. Very clean on the front. You can see the color on there and it's a little bit sparkly as well. And what is this on the back? Drifsta. What are you doing Drifsta? Sponsored by Yokohama, so it could just eat up the ground with those tires, drift around. It can go drifts there. There it is. All right, let's put these in the parking lot. The Hot Wheels parking lot gets filled up beside me here. Just crushed with cars. Then we've got the Custom 01 Acura Integra GSR. A lot to say there. White Acura Integra. And there it is. There it's got black wheels, chrome lip on there. All white and it's kind of got like a body kit. I don't know if this is a stock 
looking body kit or if it is like custom. That uh, front hood doesn't look stock to me from a Acura Integra. All right, next car we've got is the Renault Sport RS01 in silver. And I think I have this one in like maybe yellow and red as well. So they make this in quite a few different colors. So let's go ahead and open this one up. This one doesn't want to open properly here. Let's, let's get it open just like that. There we go. Pull it all out. There it is. The silver looking color on there. And this one seems really light as well. Very plasticky maybe. I don't know, could just be me if it's maybe not that much heavier. And you can even see the, the cool looking Renault all engraved, or it's not really engraved, it's kind of like out on the actual spoiler there. That's a cool touch to it, to that Renault. Throw that aside. Next up we've got the Minecraft, Minecraft car. Let's open them up, Minecraft. Ooh, there we go, Minecraft, pull them out. Check it out. And this is, I guess, where the, the Minecraft character guy is supposed to jump in there or something like that. And it's really just like a box car. There it is. And kind of interesting that Hot Wheels actually came out with a whole set of Minecraft cars and it's literally the same car as this, but just di different characters all on the actual cover of it on the actual cards, but then they did release a new Minecraft set, and I'll have a video of that out on my channel very soon. So if you're watching this video and it's old, then check out my channel, I'll probably have the video of that on there. And next up, we've got the Tigray. Tigray, there's Tigray, check out Tigray. Pretty neat, it's like a gold color Tigray. All right, let's open up Tigray. And we're on the last row almost of the 50 pack. There it is, Tigre with the red wheels on there. And it's like a matte finish bottom on Tigre. Pretty neat. It's a cool looking car. Gold, gold Tigre. All right, we'll put Tigre aside and we'll fill up the Hot Wheels parking lot. Next up, we've got the 2010 Camaro SS. Check that out, Hot Wheels Mild to Wild. I guess it's wild because they wilded it up with all the actual graphics and paint and wheels on there. So let's open up this Camaro. White interior on this Camaro, white all around, and then a nice cool like pinstripe trim on it, and the white stripe on the side of it, the slash on the side, and then it's like, yellow yellow trim on the actual wheels with black wheels with the yellow lip. I like that, that's cool. And next up we've got the 2010 Ford Mustang GT. The Mustang GT. All right, let's open up Mustang GT. And this one is yellow, yellow Mustang GT. Very neat, cool looking Mustang GT. Got the black striping on it, black wheels, and it's like a, maybe a red chrome lip on there. It's hard to say. Red, throw him aside. And ooh, the carbonator. Check out the carbonator. Carbonator is like some sort of drink. You can see more by the, the actual card than the actual car itself. So if you see the artwork on the, the card, the little dude sticking out, driving it, and it's like a bottle cap head on there. All right. Let's open it up. There we go, carbonator. It's got that uh, weird looking like bottle on there. And actually, somebody actually told me, actually I remember now, this is actually a bottle cap open it, opener. So you can actually, this little thing right here, this little thing here you can use and you can, you can open up your bottle cap with this. So that's pretty neat. Pretty cool looking car. And there we go, Voltage Spike is our next one. Voltage Spike. And this one, I don't know what this one is. Weird artwork on there. Let's open up Voltage Spike. There we go, Voltage Spike. And it's got like some sort of roll cage. 
and like plastic on the front, plastic connected on the back. What is this? Does this come off? I don't know if it doesn't. I don't think it's supposed to come off here at all. White wheels on there. Pretty neat. All right, we'll pull him aside. Ooh, the Tankinator. This is our first tank that we've gotten out of all these cars, I believe. This one looks tough. I don't wonder if this thing turns. Let's open it up. Ooh, come on, open up. Tankinator. All right, let's see if this turns. It does. Oh, that's so cool. Turns all the way around and it's got like something you can, I don't know, you can maybe play like even Lego guys or something. I don't know if they'd fit in there, probably not. But it turns all the way around. And check out these tires on here in the bottom. This thing is, it's got like slicks on the front, but it's got grippy tires on the back. That's kind of interesting. Tankinator. All right, let's throw them all into the Hot Wheels parking lot beside me here. There we go. And there we've got the Grass Chomper. Grass Chomper. That's pretty neat. Grass Chomper. All right, let's open up Grass Chomper. Obviously, it's meant to mow grass. Grass Chomper. It's got the seat on there. It's got the big exhaust that comes out right there. Check out these big exhausts on there. Fart can exhaust, I would call them. The big seat. This one, I, I would say, could fit a Lego character. It's got, even though the steering wheel is kind of cut, so it doesn't turn, but you could probably fit a Lego character in here. I don't have one to try. That would be cool if we did, though. All right, next car we've got is the Blitz Speeder. Blitz Speeder, number five. Looks like a cutoff, five, a five and another number, maybe that's kind of cut off. Blitz Speeder. Let's open up Blitz Speeder. Blitz Speeder with the blue on there, on the top. And this is like a see-through car as well. And what is this like? Flat spoiler. This thing does look like it would go fast though. Blitz Speeder. I like it. That one's cool. Blitz Speeder. All right, throw him aside. What do we got here? Ooh, we got a Dodge Viper. The SRT Viper GTSR. Need for speed, it says. Let's open it up. Our third to last car from the 50 pack. And there it is. The Dodge Viper Hot Wheels all on there. All this like artwork tempo on there. And it says SR. SR and then it looks like it's scratched off. Wow, that's weird. Is that another air car that we got? Is this our what is it, third or fourth possible air on this car? I don't I, I would assume that there's supposed to be a T on there and it just says SR. Interesting. I might have another one to compare with that, but I'll put that aside. And second last car we've got the Honda Racer. So this is some sort of weird Honda race car. Look at the front end, that's weird. And it's, oh, it's a two-seater too. Honda Racer. I haven't seen this one before. Let's open this up. Honda Racer. And it was just, the, the wheels were just racing away. So yeah, it's like a two-seater car with a big engine in there. And this is like two, four, six, eight, ten. Looks like a V10 engine. 10 cylinders there for the two people, five cylinders each. <laughs> if you do the math on that, obviously. All right, last but not least in the 50 pack, we've still got a bunch of five packs to open. This is the Ford Shelby Cobra concept car. Check that out. All right, let's open this one up. Ooh, that one just popped right out. He was just ready to come out of this 50 pack as fast as possible. There he is, got the cool looking five star staggered chrome wheels and the nice striping on it. It's like the new Cobra. They, they didn't really make this in, in real life, but, uh, or they, I guess they made a concept version, but they never came production version of this car. But I think it's a pretty cool looking car. All right, we'll throw him aside and now let's get to the rest of the five packs here. All right, next I've got this five pack, and this is a little bit older pack called Racers. And I bought this specifically because of the F40 that's in there. And you can see I paid $7.95 for it. 
Let's open it up. Got some cool cars in here. Come on, come on. Ooh, open, open, there we go. Pull this one open there. And look at the old style packaging as well, like 90s packaging. They've made it all like actual clear now, as opposed to this is kind of like a gray color. Still looks pretty neat though. All right, let's uh, pull out the first car in here is the F40. And what you don't see very often anymore is cars that have the openings on them. So this F40 obviously has that cool opening on there. And this is the older wheels on there. You don't see those wheels anymore either. You can even see like, yeah, maybe not the best quality back in the 90s, but it's okay. Throw him aside there. Then we've got this one, which is some sort of race car. And I know I have old ones of these as well. And this one, you can see if you push that back, that's about all it goes. And you can see the little engine back there. So it's a cool detail, nice touch. You don't really see that very often anymore, if at all. Throw him there. Then this one looks like some sort of Monte Carlo. Check out the sparkles on that. Look at the sparkles in the light there. Wow, that is pretty neat. And it's got those different old wheels, even older ones than the previous wheels on the, the, the race car and the F40. Same with this one right here. This is like some sort of F1 or Indy car. It could be yellow, the older style Hot Wheels logo on it, obviously, because this one was an older car. And it's, uh, look at the unpainted bottom, which kind of blends into the unpainted rear spoiler. That's pretty neat. Check out the back. And then it goes to the front. Awesome, we'll throw that one aside. And then next up we've got this other sort of older style race car. Check it out, older style wheels on there. Check it out, pretty neat. Cool, throw him aside and let's fill up the Hot Wheels parking lot now. Throw all these cars to the side here. We've got so many cars in the parking lot now. The parking lot, we're gonna have to push back. There we go, all right. And then let's pull this one right here that we can see. So we've got the Victory Lane. This one is probably like an er maybe early 2000-ish. Uh, yeah, I'd say somewhere around there, early 2000s. So you can see it's got the clear inside. We'll open it up though. Oh, and I've got this remaining from the other package over here. Throw that aside. Come on. Look at all the old glue on there as well. So it's kind of like all dried up. I'm just gonna rip this one open here. Oh, all the cars, oh, that's, that's interesting. So the way they did this five pack is clear all up here and then we flip it. Here, let's open this just like that. And you can see it's two pieces that come together and they're, it's connected all right here. That's kind of interesting. So let's see what do we have here. This looks like, uh, I don't even know what this car is. Could be like a GTO or like one of those Australian race cars. I'm not 100% sure on this one. Pretty neat looking though. So that aside, then we've got the, this is the Corvette Callaway. I think I have some different ones of these. They're still making these wheels and tires though, or wheels, obviously tires are kind of the same. I really, really like these wheels though. Some of the best older wheels. And then I bought this pack specifically for this. The yellow Ferrari F355. There we go. Check it out. Got the chrome five stars on there. Very, very nice. Let's roll it on over there. <laughs> All right. And next one in this pack, we've got, uh, I don't know what this is. Maybe a Cosworth or something. What does it say on the bottom here? Uh, let me look closer on the bottom. Uh, Escort Rally, there we go. So it's the Ford Escort Rally car. And you can see the rally lights on the front. And actually, I'm gonna look at the back of the first five car, the first 
car from this pack and this is the SS Commodore. So there you go, if you're looking, SS Commodore, roll it on over there. And uh, then obviously the Escort, we'll throw this one over there as well. And the last one of this is this like racing truck. Number 12 racing truck. And what does this one say on the bottom here? Uh, I don't even know what this one is. Semi fast or something maybe? I can't, I can't barely read it. But uh, if you know what it is, post in the comments below. This is a pretty cool one though. Number 12 on there. All right, let's roll this one aside and let's throw these remaining cars here into the Hot Wheels 100 car parking garage, which is scattered all under there. And we'll move up top here, the second to last pack. This is the Hot Wheels Exotics five pack. This is a new five pack you can still get in stores if you're watching this video in when I first post it here in October. Let's open that up and I'll throw this aside. So the first car up top is the Pagani Waira. Pagani Waira, some newer style wheels on there. Got the stripe on it. Check out that stripe on there. Boom, that's pretty neat. Gotta like that one. The Pagani Waira. We'll throw the Waira over there. Then we've got the Aston Martin. This is the DBS, DB9, what is this? Uh, I don't know, I think this might be a DB9 or it could be the Vanquish. Throw some comments down below if you know the exact model of this one. There we go, pretty neat. All right, throw that one down. Then we've got the Lamborghini Huracan, the red Lamborghini Huracan. Check out the stripes down the center. This is a very popular, good looking car, the Lamborghini Huracan. I'm a big fan of it, I like it. Lamborghini Huracan, we'll throw that one on the side there. Next up we've got the Porsche Carrera GT. Check out the Porsche Carrera GT on there. Very nice, awesome looking car. Porsche Carrera GT, and next up we've got the Lamborghini Aventador J. Aventador J, Lamborghini. Boom, boom. Check out the two-seater Roadster Lamborghini. That's different, we don't see this one very often. All right, throw that aside. And we are coming up to our last five cars, our last five pack right there. So there it is, the Flames, Hot Wheels Flames five pack. Let's open this one up. Ooh, let's rip this open. There we go. Boom, there's the last five pack. I'll throw the pack aside, we'll go through each car here. First car, this one's like a, a lowered car. I don't know the exact car of this, it's some sort of lowered car. Let's see if I can read on the back here what it actually says. Impala, of course I should know it's the Impala. 68 Impala, there it is. Neat looking car. All right. And next up we've got is this one. This is like a Camaro. It's a flamed out Camaro. It's gotta be a flamed out Camaro. There it is, the flame job on that Camaro. And look at the interior, the nice interior on there. And those cool looking five star wheels. They're like those Krager wheels. A lot of muscle cars like those wheels on there. All right, let's open it up. Next one we've got, and this one is, what is this, a GTO? No, Nova. This is a 66 Nova. There it is. 66 Nova, look at the flames on that. Wow, crazy flame job. I love those new wheels and tires as well. And then we've got a Mustang. This is a cool looking Mustang. It's a black Mustang with a flame job on it. That is really nice, I like this one. It's one of my favorites of this pack. The black Mustangs, gotta like black Mustangs, so classic. 
All right, we'll put the Mustang aside. And our very last car, let me just straighten my camera out for a second. Boom, we've got the flamed out Hot Wheels van, car 100. That is neat, I like those wheels on there. That, the wheels really suit this van. Makes it look really cool, it kind of matches the flames on there. And check out the four passenger interior, and then the back of it's got something in the, oh, maybe kids or something in the back, or I don't know what it is in the back, but that's a cool looking car. Car number 100, give it credit. All right, let's look at the Hot Wheels garage, which is has all 100 cars in it. All right, guys, here is a look at the 100 cars that we just opened up. And I want you guys to post in the comments down below, which was your favorite car out of all 100 here. Post those comments down below. Let me know what you guys think your favorite car is. All right, guys, thanks a lot for watching this video. I'll catch you on the next one, bye-bye. What's up, Peak Timers? This is your boy, Phil, from Peak Time Racing. I just want to thank you all for watching this video. Now, I just want to make sure you guys are fully aware of the Peak Time Racing brand, which consists of all three of these channels right here. We've got Peak Time Racing, which is the channel you're on right now. We've got Peak Time Vlogs, which is my vlogging channel where you can find more stuff about my daily life, my family, and a lot more behind the scenes things, as well as Peak Time TV, which is my gaming channel, mixed in with a little bit of a storyline channel with Hot Wheels, some really cool stories and Hot Wheels stuff in there as well. I just want to make sure you guys don't miss out on a video that I post, so be sure to subscribe to all three of those channels. I will be doing a monthly giveaway and all you have to do to enter is post on any one of my videos and any one of my channels that you are subscribed to all three of the Peak Time Racing branded channels. I'll be picking one lucky winner each month at random who will receive a prize package of Peak Time Racing branded things as well as Hot Wheels. Thanks again for watching this one. I'll catch you guys on the next video. Bye-bye.